Let's talk about some of the words of the president uh, from last night. Could you tell us more about these claims of former DFA Secretary Albert Del Rosario regarding China's supposed involvement in the results of the 2016 elections? Well, Charles, if you recall last week, um, uh, former Foreign Affairs uh, Secretary uh, Albert Del Rosario uh, issued a statement saying that he received reports from China that uh, some Chinese uh, officials are saying that uh, they have actually influenced the result of the uh, 2016 elections, um, which actually resulted to uh, President Duterte being uh, the chief executive of the country. And of course, President Duterte, uh, this, this statement does not sit well with uh, President Duterte. He actually lambasted Foreign Affairs uh, Secretary uh, Del Rosario last night after hearing this uh, issue. Yeah, we did hear earlier, Maced, that the president does intend to go after uh, former Secretary Del Rosario. But then, uh, what does the government plan to do about Del Rosario's claims? Uh, that's, that's the thing, Charles. Last night, President Duterte lambasted uh, Secretary Del Rosario, but he did not explain the basis of uh, such accusations. For example, when President Duterte said that, uh, pre that the former Secretary Del Rosario can face uh, treason, he did not elaborate what's the basis of uh, that particular uh, case if they are planning to uh, file it against Secretary Del Rosario. Um, uh, another thing, President Duterte also uh, accused um, uh, former Secretary Del Rosario that he is not a Filipino, but the President did not elaborate what's the basis of uh, that particular statement. Um, except that, President Duterte uh, said that uh, it seems that Secretary Del Rosario is not a Filipino based on his uh, looks. But um, if uh, you recall, I think that was last week, Presidential Secretary or Presidential Spokesperson Harry Roque already encouraged uh, the lawyers to uh, look into the case of uh, Secretary uh, Del Rosario. Um, uh, and uh, look into the possibility that he has liability uh, when it comes to the decision on, uh, on uh, directing our, um, our uh, troops to pull out from the Scarborough Shoal. Thank you for those updates, Mase. That was Maricel Halili reporting live from Mandaluyong.